Okay, race 28. Can Josh make it four wins in a row here at Leopardstown with the December Festival Hurdle? It's another Grade 1 event. So Josh has picked up two Grade 1s and a Grade 2 in the last three. Ooh, I wouldn't like to yawn. Anyway, it's two mile one fern on grade one. Albert's eyes for Molly at Surfer. Amtrak Journey for Darren Thompson. Devil's King for Jim Murray. Carl Lagerfield for Molly at Surfer. Playground for Martin Lee. And Rainer's Lane for Connor Aganti. Stern Test for David Robertson. Time for a show under a bit of pressure from Joshua Sullivan. Bounty Mister for Del Hinton. Cheltenham Fund for Pontypool Racing. And the head wreck of Paul Rhodes. Unlimited power. The favourite for Joshua Sullivan. And vocal performance Carl Aganti. Paul picked up three in a row at Cheltenham earlier in the week. Josh has thrown down the gauntlet and equaled that. We'll now look to see if he can do four in a row. We can wait for him to settle down the first, the, through the first furlong. There's obviously a bit of fog now here. As you can see, there's a Land Rover stables, I assume. And we're going to be led by the head wrecker. We've only got four flights to take here for the December festival. Four. Over two miles. Crazy. Anyway, it's the head wrecker that leads by about six to Stern Test and Rainers Lena together with Carl Lagerfeld. Sad we lost him this year. Although he was a bit of a weirdo in my opinion. Although he made a really nice aftershave, I remember back in the 90s. Anyway, it's the head wrecker that leads from Rainers Lane and Stern Test. Jump on fun wide. Carl Lagerfeld against the fence. Devil's King widest of all, along with vocal performance on his inside. And the Amtrak journey as we head towards the fence, the first of the, uh, the Southern Horses, unlimited power. And Bounty Mr. Albert's eyes in time for a show. The favourite just at the rear. Well held up. So we might get to the second hurdle. Oh no, it's the first hurdle. We finally got there and everybody was over it. So that was four from home. With a mile and a quarter to run. Paul Rose's head wrecker. He's going to try and stop the Sutherland machine. Winning four on the bounce. We get to the second. Everybody's over it. His lead's uh, cut into now by Rainers Lane. Then we've got Cheltenham Fun now. Wide playground. Stern test vocal performance. And the first of the Sutherland horses. Unlimited power. And time for a show moving through now. Molly at surface. Albert's eyes there against the fence. Bounty missed up. Carl Lagerfeld, widest of all is Jim's Devil's King, and then Darren Thompson's Amtrak journey just bringing up the rear. And it looks like we're going to have a bit of a jockey cam inside the final mile now. We're on Albert's eyes, pushing through that. Carl's horse on the left, Martin Lindham's on the right, pushing through quite well here. Going up a position there in Albert's eyes. We're still being led by the head wrecker. Out of the pack comes time for a show. Head wrecker inside the six. Time for a show is second. Albert's eyes is third. Out wide, fourth is Devil's King. Pushing through is the Pontypool Colours of Cheltenham Fund. But it's the head wrecker by a couple to time for a show. Bounty Mister making up some ground now, being pushed out of the pack. Out wide is still is Devil's King. But it's the head wrecker inside the four from Cheltenham Fund that takes over from Time for a Show. But Time for a Show pushes forward again. Bounty Mister's got nowhere to go. Comes unlimited power through the pack. Albert's eyes is still there, plugging on really well. Is still his Devil's King, but inside the three, it's Head Wrecker, and here comes unlimited power to throw down a challenge from Albert's eyes. Devil's King out wide. Time for a show doesn't look like he's got a lot left, so it's going to be unlimited power that might will take inside the two. So it's Head Wrecker, unlimited power. Two top trainers of the season so far, Paul Rose and Josh Sutherland. But here comes Unlimited Power at the last, but Head Wrecker got away from it quickest. So it's the Head Wrecker inside the final furlong, but here comes Unlimited Power on his outside. The Head Wrecker trying to hang on here. He needs the post. Here comes Unlimited Power as they get towards the line. It's Unlimited Power. The Head Wrecker. The Head Wrecker, I think, just hung on to it there. Paul Rose stops. Josh Sutherland picking up four in a row, I think. Let's see. I'm not sure with the, the angle of the camera. The head wrecker takes it from unlimited power and time for a show. Thank God we couldn't have four wins in a row. We'd all be turning off. No. Great win there for the head wrecker. Hung on to stop the four timer.
from unlimited power for Joshua Sutherland in second, third, time for a show for Joshua Sutherland, fourth, Albert's eyes for Molly at surfer, along with Carl Argerfield to run on well to get up for fifth. 